The Reserve Bank of India is set to review its policy tomorrow. And according to a Bloomberg poll, an overwhelming number of economists predict no change in key policy rates. Diana is standing by with some numbers. Well, one of the most uh, important policy decisions in a while, and not because we're expecting any, any kind of change in the broad uh, rates uh, per se, but uh, two main questions need to be answers, answered. Uh, firstly, will the tightening measures that were taken over the last two weeks get reversed anytime soon? And uh, where really does policy stance uh, currently stand at? Is there a reversal in policy stance? With that backdrop, let's uh, take a look at what really the poll is indicating. Uh, firstly, on the CRR front, 95% of economists believe that there'll be no change in uh, the CRR. 5% which means just one economist actually believe that there could be an actual hike in CRR by a 50 basis points. On the repo and the reverse repo, which is the actual rate at which the Reserve Bank of India lends as well as borrows, we're expecting 100% economists believe that there'll be no change in rates. Now, what's really the rationale for this? Firstly, the rupee has uh, tanked over the last couple of months, so 9.5% is what we've lost since April, and the Reserve Bank of India over the last uh, two weeks has been tightening liquidity in an effort to rein in uh, the kind of depreciation that we've been seeing on the currency. On the other hand, CPI continues to remain elevated. Over 9% is where it has stood at over the last one year. And food inflation as well has remained elevated. Now, beyond the rates, so what really will we be watching out for? Well, in terms of forecasts and the actual growth rates, well, economists have been lowering their growth forecast for FY14. The Reserve Bank of India's forecast stands at 5.7%, but a lot of economists have been talking about growth between 5 to 5.3% for the full year. So that could get revised on the downward side. As far as inflation is concerned, what's going to be the implications of the rupee depreciation? That's also likely to be commentary made by the Reserve Bank of India. Also, whether they're going to be able to meet the credit and deposit growth targets that they've set out for the full year because currently we're not really meeting that.